Hey guys, so I'm going to quickly show you how to, bit, to book a full package on Delta Vacations for Travel Agents. So the website is ruralagentdirect.com. And so Delta is one of those travel suppliers where the agency owner has to add you to that account. So if you're one of my agents and you need access to this, then you need to go ahead and request access in your travel agent portal. So nonetheless, here we are. And so um, there's a few things that I really, really like about um, Delta Vacations. One of them is their advanced vacation search option. So if you go here, you will notice that there um, is a multi-destination um, package, right? So you can go from one city to the other. You know what? Let's do it. So see you. And then say um, departure date. I'm just making up some dates. So, so, you know, some some travel suppliers have this, some of them don't. And then I do notice that a lot of the travel suppliers that do have this, maybe their deposits are like really, really, really high. So, um, you know, but Delta's deposits are, you know, really, really good. So, okay, so let's say um, Tampa to, to Cancun and then from Cancun over to, let's say, um, let's say Hawaii, HNL. I'm just really making up something right about now. And so flight is needed, flight is needed, hotel is needed, hotel is needed here as well. And then let's say when's the departure date. So let's say a week in Hawaii and then leaving Hawaii, coming back on in, All right? All right, so flight needed. All right, so let's say two adults, okay? And then another thing that I like about Delta, um, all of their promo codes are on the front end. Let's see. So if you come on over here to special deals and offers, you'll notice a bunch of different promo codes for your client. Okay. Okay. So we got that there. All right. So let's do it. So let's just pretend like we like this flight. So let's just pick Delta. All right, so let's pretend like we like this flight. I'm just picking the flight. I'm honestly not even looking at it at all since it's such a quick training. And so let's just pick this one. Hopefully it's a good flight. <laughs> then so I'm gonna click continue, basically saying I overlooked the flights again and they look pretty good. So let's keep going. What? Let's go back. Let's go back. Come on, come on, come on. So with Delta, um, I noticed that they do have a lot of tour options. And of course, they have the rental cars that you can automatically add on. Um, I do notice that with Delta, they do have more tour options than normal. Um, all of the other tour suppliers when it comes to building packages and stuff, you know, having everything in one package. Come on. And then so for the most part, Delta vacations deposits are around about $200. So I don't know. I, I don't. Sometimes it changes. Like I, I, I uh, looked at a really expensive flight and then it was no longer 200 and something dollars. It was like $800 for two people. So I was like, I don't I don't understand the, the structure of it. But for the most part, they're around 200 to 250 dollars. So let's see. Per person, I'll say that. Okay, so it doesn't like my search. Okay, so maybe we won't go from Cancun to Hawaii. <laughs> All right, so maybe let's um, let's start over. All right, so just putting something at this point. All right, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna do a regular vacation package search. It's probably too complicated. Okay, so flight and hotel. Okay, we got that. We got that. Let's say 10 nights in Cancun. All right. All right, so let's pick this.
It's a searching, it's a searching. All right, let's find the hotel. I think I like this one. All right, so this is a whole curse word, non-refundable. Um, they do have other options. So let's maybe, let's, you know, let's look at this. This should be pretty good. All right, so let's go ahead and purchase some transportation. Okay, this is a brown trip, right? Share, right, nonstop transfer. Okay, so no rental car is desired. All right, so let's go ahead and add a tour. Right. All right, so over here, um, one thing that I do like about their vacation protection, um, this is powered through Allianz. So Allianz is one of our favorite um, suppliers when it comes to travel insurance. And so from my understanding, um, this is kind of sort of like a, a council for any reason policy as well as health coverage. Like, well, not health coverage, medical coverage, like on a, a regular travel insurance policy. Um, let's see. So over here, the one, the regular plan is 200 per person. And then the travel protection plan plus is 300 per person. I tend not to choose these because I feel like, you know, I can probably get my client a better deal um, by booking their insurance separate. But hey, this is all up to you and your client, okay? And so here's the cancellation um, penalties and the fees. So if, they, if we cancel this before May the 4th, um, it will be... A zero penalty, which is which is pretty good. And so this is without the coverage. Okay. And then so over here we got the agency service charge. So um if you found a um a deal for really, really, really cheap, you can of course mark it up. But the only thing that I can say about Delta and added in agent markup is that if you um if you put an extra hundred or two hundred dollars in an agent markup, then it's gonna add it into the cost of the deposit. So you know, instead of the client having to pay a four hundred dollar, um, well, two hundred dollar per person deposit or two fifty, it's gonna, you know, make it three fifty or something like that per person. So, um, what could be done, like let's say, if you um found the package and that was way cheaper, um, you can of course still price it at that amount, and then towards the final payment, make sure Delta adds on your two hundred dollars or whatever the the extra agent markup is, and then for the final payment for that, it still will get paid. Um pay like normal. So if it was this, you know, the total will be 90, 99.04.65. And so that's what we're going all of the documents because at the end, the final payment will be your extra agent markup. And so, like I said, if you're out there really finding trips like way cheaper than everybody else, let's say that this trip was like 10,000 plus dollars, like, yeah, you deserve to add in your agent markup. Never feel bad about adding in your agent markup because this is business. You know, we're of course finding our clients really, really good deals, but if there's room to add an extra commission and still give your client a discount, then by all means, go ahead and add that, okay? So it's gonna, of course, ask you, where do you want the documents to be emailed to? And so you guys already know, email those documents to yourself and then forward those to your clients because if anything happens with the flights or anything, you'll be one of the first people to know. And so you can guide your client along that way, okay? So we got all of this over here. And so look at here, the deposit is due um, three days from now. Um, it was just four hundred dollars, and then the remaining is due um, on May the fourth. Okay, and then so it shows you the cancellation um, penalty again, and so um, Delta kind of sort of hides their uh, their commission. So let's see. Um, I think this commission is pretty low, but the only thing I can say about Delta is that we don't book a lot over here in Delta because the commission is low. So um, over here, we can always add in promo codes to bring down bring down everything so um i think it was um s m w a 300 w a y i think that's what it is and then you're gonna if it starts with the s m um uh, we enter s m s ways if it starts with s m it's gonna need a um a delta um you know one of those not, not one of those. If it starts with, if the promo code starts with an SM, it's going to automatically need like your Delta, um, 
client, your client's Delta, you know, traveler number, you know, each, each airline or each, you know, supplier, if they book with them, it has like their customer, um, what is it, you know, their program. So Delta, um, oh, Sky Miles, Lord have mercy, that's what it's called. Um, if it starts with the SM, you're going to have to input um, your client's Sky Miles number, okay? So this knocked off uh, $300. And so now the total for the client is 9404 okay? And so the commission does not change at all. It's still $733, okay? And so right here, you just select that you accept all of this goodness and then you can come on over here and confirm it. And when you confirm it, it's going to hold your price until the, um, the, the final due date, which is right here. And if you don't pay it, it's going to automatically fall off. So um, let's see. And let's say you're trying to copy and paste this bad boy to Travel Joy. You're going to come right there to print email. Let me see if you can see it. I'm going to share it. All right. Right, so this is what you'll see, okay? If you're trying to copy and paste this to Travel Joy, it'll be right here, okay? And then so um, you can print it off as a PDF if you need it to. So all of that is there. If you guys have any more questions about how to book Delta um, as a travel agent, just let me know, okay? But don't forget to, to check where you can find your commissions at. And it's, um, it's always down here under agent details. And so if you're over here in Delta and you see something and you see like the commission isn't that great, it's okay. This is why we're with multiple travel suppliers. Go ahead and search with another travel supplier and see if you can find that same flight, that same exact hotel for a better rate, okay? And if you if you can find it for a better rate and of course the, the commission is good and the deposit is good, listen, by all means, book, book in another travel supplier. Um, you know, we're looking out for our client's best interest as well as our best interest when it comes to our commissions as well. So you don't have to use Delta if, you know, you feel like the commission is super low, just always, you know, I say search three different places, okay? So that's all I have about Delta. If you guys have any additional questions, just let me know.